Hey YouTubers, this is Lonnie Clark, Nuts for Art. Um, you know, it's pretty hard for me to get to work these days because we're watching uh, really the entire world process completely ignore the fact that uranium mining, that Fukushima is out of control, the news from e, &E News, which weirdly enough has sta started popping up again. Uh, we're hearing... Uh, I mean, the news on E&E &E News about Fukushima is catastrophic in its own. Hasn't made a single word on any news media that I've seen at all. Alternative news, mainstream news. The only people talking about it is us YouTubers. Um, it's pretty devastating. I mean, our children are being killed as we speak. Uh, what I read this morning that TEPCO... Uh, is being sued by a uranium mining company in Canada. They've already bought millions of pounds of uranium that they can't even use. Uh, just the craziness of it all. Just, it's, it's off the charts incredibly insane. People are out in the streets over a fucking Muslim ban that really Obama put down. I mean, Trump is just doing the low-hanging fruit. And it's stunning. It's, I'm, I'm just nonplussed and just can't even fucking get over it. Like, the hate machine. I mean, on this very YouTube channel, people will have called me names because I defend Planned Parenthood and tell me that I must be that kind of person. You know what kind of person I am? I'm a human being with a heart that still feels. Our, our children are being killed, folks. Our planet is dying. The mass animal deaths are off the charts. Never a word about nuclear pollution. Never one word about nuclear pollution. Never one word about nuclear pollution ever makes it to any media about the cause. Just this morning, there's a story up by the Tri-Cities. I think it said they found 500 ducks dead from avian flu. The Tri-Cities, right where Hanford is. We YouTubers have been on the YouTube channel jumping up and down for six fucking years now. Trying to make people pay attention. And, okay, 25, 30,000 people out of billions of people on this goddamn planet care. I mean, it's incomprehensible. It's just, what is it going to take for, isn't it, you know, Agarman says, act your conscience, act your conscience. Well, if people don't put the facts into their little pea brains, into their consciousness, they're not going to act on it. I mean, every single nuclear power plant needs to be shut down. Cleaning up the contamination on our planet needs to be our number one priority. Number one, not war, not selling war weapons, not doing any of that. Remediating the soil, fixing the fucking ocean before it's completely dead. What is it going to take? This sign, when scientists lie, people die. And, you know, people are just like, oh, well, you know, that's the way it goes. And you have the courage. You can do it because you're strong enough. You can do it. Well, fuck you. Every single person on this planet needs to be doing something to stop it. I mean, put your courage feet on. Find your courage. Take action. I mean, we have... I get it, these people, they don't want to participate with the government because what's the point? We have a military that is running the world and killing us all with nuclear pollution. Think of all the nuclear submarines that are around the world right this very second that have had nuclear accidents that we're not even being told because they belong to the military. Every single submarine the United States has is a nuclear weapon. It's a nuclear bomb, essentially, floating around in the ocean. I don't know what humanity thinks we're going to do, folks. People need to find their courage. People need to find their voice. They need to find their integrity, their humanities. The water protector standing up for the water. Really? What about the water? What about the uranium mining? 
What about the nuclear pollution? Tritium in our water, we can't separate tritium. It's H3O. It's not H2O, it's H3O, which means you can't separate the water from the tritium, folks. It's going to get worse and worse and worse. We absolutely, this is a critical mass emergency. Didn't anybody see the news on ENE News this morning? I mean, it's fucking off the charts. It's absolutely beyond, 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 beyond outrageous. It's like so fucking out of this world, beyond outrageous. People think the fucking aliens, the outsiders are going to come and help us. They're not fucking coming for us, folks. We're on our own. And the archangels, oh, the angels are going to help us. We're on our fucking own. We are it. Whatever it is you want to believe in, we're it. It doesn't matter. What matters is we might be a spirit living in a body, but guess what? Our bodies are going to get polluted with nuclear pollution. Our children will not be able to live to adulthood. It's... It's beyond comprehension that people just want to pretend like they can just destroy our planet and there's not going to be any consequences. We, we ought not to be getting used to everybody having cancer. 50% of the United States getting cancer. Cancer is the number one killer of children. Well, what about autism, schizophrenia, genetic mutations, things that are happening all the time? And people that have been affected, they say, well, I have this, and do you think it was caused because I live right next door to a nuclear power plant? Fuck yes! Yes, yes, and yes! I mean, San Onofre is fucking off the charts bad, and it's closed down. Indian Point is fucking off the charts bad. There's bolts missing inside of Indian Point. Turkey Point out in Florida, nonstop leak. And there are dead animals, three whales washed up today. It's fucking off the charts, you guys. We're on YouTube. You People that follow my channel, they want to be inspired. They want to hear what I have to say. We share with each other's ideas. We uh, support each other, no matter what, how we believe. I mean, I think that the YouTube community is harsh, but at the same time, it's very supporting. Because people don't have to agree with us. And you know what happens? Mainstream, they just ignore us. They don't give a flying fuck. They're voting right now to give Rex Tillerson and Vladimir Putin control of the White House. I mean, we're going to have Rick Perry, a guy with a Bachelor's of Arts degree in animal science, running the Department of Energy. He oversaw the biggest nuclear spill in Texas, summarily got put on the board of that same waste company, and just resigned in December so he could take over the Department of Energy. Oops, the, uh, oops, the agency that he couldn't remember the name of that he wanted to promise to shut down. He didn't have to get elected. Trump, he's going to let him do it for him. Who do these people think they are? That money at all costs, profit at all costs over life is worth it? It's not about just making money. We are in serious hurts, folks. And I hope that people, I hope this message inspires some people to take some action. To find out what you can do to stop the tide. I mean, we have got to be the tsunami that comes all the way in and yanks it out and stops it. Because there's these folks, these scientists, do you think those fucking scientists that are planning on marching on Washington, D.C. are even going to mention nuclear pollution? Fuck no! They want their little jobs from Monsanto and... From TEPCO and all those other places, you know, all the other, what is it, ACA, ATA, out there in Corvallis, one of the hottest nuclear sites in Oregon. I just had to put this message out. I, I have not written, read any of my story that I'm reading to you guys, mostly because I've been occupied with my family for the last week. And for the last two days, I just, honestly, my heart is breaking. I'm sick of having a broken heart over the fact that people don't love each other enough and care enough. 
I don't know what it's going to take, folks, but we have got to get active, every one of us. If each one of us could get three people, do you know how many people that would be? A lot. I don't know what we're going to do, but we've got to do something because we're just watching us just like lemmings, just dropping off the cliff, just falling off. Well, put your courage feet on, you guys. Please take some action. Um, I don't know what the answers are, but I'm just fucking blown away that there is nothing being done. That there's no major... I mean, we are it. We're the major organizations, and we're being stopped because we don't have the funds. We don't have the money. We don't have the power. We can't even get in to see these motherfuckers. I don't know what it's going to take, but man... It's just, uh, I guess it's a tea kettle here. That's all we are. Put your courage feet on, you guys. Please do take some action. Ciao.